Okay, hello everyone. Welcome back to The Sims 4 Far From Home LP. I was going to show you guys interrogation, but it, I guess it just kind of rolled over from the other one. Get confession. So we're going to get the confession. So, yeah. Confess your sins. That's right. The guilty never win. Okay, so we need to take a civilian report. Also, um, so Sandra did get a case closed. Nice work. That's one more div criminal off the streets. Unfortunately, crime never sleeps and we have another case waiting for you. Get the assignment from a computer and get back out there. Anyway, so I'm going to take a mugshot because you guys haven't seen that. At least for me. I'm sure you've seen it from elsewhere, but we'll take a mugshot. Um, so Cassandra got a promotion because... I went ahead and played through that day, but uh, she got two more breakthroughs after she got promoted pretty quickly, and one of them was the satellite, which means that the possibility of Otis getting abducted has increased significantly. So her next work day, which we're going to do tomorrow, she's going to be able to build it, and I'm really excited about it. She does work tomorrow, right? Yeah, she gets the weekend off, right? Yeah, okay. So I'm really excited about this. Very, very, very excited. Uh, take civilian police report. So we'll do that. I uh, probably should have locked her in the cell. She's going to work hard. She might end up getting another promotion, but... Some kids have been running through the neighborhood pool jumping. What do you mean? That sounds like fun. They are trespassing. Oh, okay. I was like, where did the person go? Get a case assignment. Okay. Um, how about we browse police database just to get that extra oomph and then we'll get our case assignment. Actually, no, we need to go on patrol. I know that that has, it's not telling us to do that, but we do need to go on patrol so that we can get our promotion because we are ready for promotion. All we need to do is go on patrol. So that's what we're going to do. Once he does the database thing, however long he decides that's going to take him. Um, I'm hoping to show her job too because I want to get the satellite. So when we implement the satellite, I'm I'm really excited. I want him to become abducted so bad. You guys have no idea. I'm so excited about this. All right. So also we have um. Ooh, what's going on here? So oh look, there's our house. We've also started building the rocket ship, which is why we have like no bunny, and we finished building the rocket ship at the uh, science facility. So. Yes. What do I need to do? I need to issue, spend two hours on patrol, and issue a citation chat with civilians. So I am on patrol. Yeah. I am doing the patrolling thing. But there's, like, nobody here. This is a civilian, right? So we could chat with her. Right? I assume that person's angry, which means that they're going to try to pick a fight. Okay, cool. Chat with more civilians. Cool. Whoa. Well, there's a fight if I've ever seen one. Issue citation. There we go. Whoa, why am I uncomfortable? Fight witness. Otis isn't too comfortable with the first, with the fist match that just occurred nearby. Well, that happens. Issue more citations. Holy crap. Who do I need to issue a citation to? Here we go. Nice, and a citation to that one. Heck yeah. Okay, we're going to return to the police station because we are done with being on patrol. I gave so many citations, everybody got in trouble. Do not mess with police officer Otis. That does not sound intimidating at all, but it's fine. Maybe Officer Hall sounds better. Yeah. 
Okay, so we are at the police station. Um, what do we need to do? Get a case assignment. Okay, so we can do that. Hello. Get a case assignment. I don't know how far we're going to get on it. I'm, I'm not planning on him working late at all this time. Usually I do that, but I'm not feeling it this time around. I need you to move, dude. Whoever you are. Tristan Edgar. You have two first names. Alright. Go away, Jody. I don't want to talk to you. I'm working here. Go on patrol. No way. Travel to crime scene. Search criminals at the booking station. Okay. Whoa, hello. Search subs suspect. Uh, we'll do this guy, Soren Wise. Obviously was not very wise. Ha 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 ha. I know, I'm hilarious. So funny. You going? Okay, so we're gonna do this. Um, I don't want to travel to the crime scene, because we don't really got a whole lot of time to do that. What's happening here? This is so interesting. I can't wait to, sh to show you guys the interrogation process, because that's actually really cool. I wish I showed that to you guys. It's very cool. Okay. What is this? Up close and personal. Unfortunately, cleanliness isn't a requirement for being a criminal. Alright, well, he can go back in his cell. That's awesome. Um, where do you think you're going, dude? Trying to make a break for it? I mean, I understand, but that's just not going to happen. We're going to discuss case theories. We're going to get a promotion, which is awesome. Which means a little bit of extra law for us. Is that... Are we good? Did that count? Hello? Maybe? Not? I don't... Okay. Alright. It's like, it's weird and it just kind of stops doing. Take mug shots. Uh, let's do... That person. Mixing it up every time. Okay, so he leaves in an hour. Okay, come on. We don't get a whole lot of time for this now. Or we don't have any time for this because workday is over. I guess not. I don't know. It gets glitchy and weird. There's a mugshot. Awesome. It's so cool. This is, this is a cool, uh, there we go. Whoa! So we got promoted to Corporal. We have received a modern cell towel rack, a glass metal shelf, a glass, yeah, glass metal shelf, the lonely man shelf, cold steel, a wall bench, the hard time mirror, the solitary sleeper, the impenetrable, $224, jaded cell depository, holy door of holding, single serving justice dispenser, the impossible, and the don't even try. Holy crap, why did we get so much stuff? We got so much stuff. I'll have to look at that in our inventory when we get back. Alright, so Corporal, and we got so much crap. Let me look in our inventory real quick. What in the world just happened? The don't even try. So basically we can build our own little prison. We have a little bed, which we'll use if we ever have children. We could use a mirror. Or not. Yeah, I'll just put it over the toilet. That's a thing, I guess. Can we change the color? To be more friendly and hospitable? <laughs> we got this awesome toilet. <laughs> Strange. We got a wall bench. We got a whole bunch of stuff. Towel rack. Hmm. Can we put it there? Yeah, we'll put it there. That's interesting. Well, we used some of it. We got a little bit of decorations. I guess we could use this toilet, but... It's kind of crazy looking. I don't know about that. It's a little strange. <laughs> Alright, well that's neat. We could sell it for money. So we need to, for our next promotion, we have to interrogate a suspect. So for now, he's going to go to the bathroom and eat. And he can have some franken beans. He's not doing a whole lot. And then he's going to watch some television. Uh, you like action. And look, there's, I made the hover lamp. 
There it is. It makes a crazy noise, so I try to stay away from it because it's actually really loud. Although I guess I could turn off the hovering and then it wouldn't make that noise. But it's cool. I like it. It's neat. So Cassandra came back. She didn't get a promotion, which is fine, but she does need to eat. She didn't really get a whole lot happening, but that's fine. Uh, she's going to have some eggs, grab a serving, and she's going to go to the bathroom. And she's going to watch some television, too. That sounds good. Why don't you clean up? for me, sir, and I want him to work on this for a little bit, just continue building. We don't really need to do it, but I figure we might as well. And then she's gonna go to bed pretty soon. Probably. I don't know, we might get them to flirt a little bit. Not a whole lot, but just a little bit. As soon as she's finished getting her happiness going, because they're not exactly happy, either one of them at the moment. Alright. That is a small bathroom. She's going to... Let's watch Romance. That might increase her happiness a little bit quicker. It looks like it is, actually. I might be imagining that, but I don't know. Heal shower. He doesn't need it, but we might as well. Oh, did he get to the next stage? Nope. Sure didn't. So... Oh, no. She's still watching action. Never mind. She's enjoying the action of it all. That's cool. Alright, you can turn this off. It might help. Why don't you play a video game? We're gonna need to get them some video games because they're just not having it. Play a game. But we don't wanna we don't really have a whole lot of money, so. Did that help at all? A little bit. Yeah, it decreased it a good bit. Uh whoops. Alright, so. Hmm. Let's be a little friendly. Let's have a deep conversation. Let's vent. So they're both quite uncomfortable. They're both pretty tense at the moment. Hmm. wonder if being, like, talking about geeky stuff, like debating captains or whatever, will help with their geeky thing. Their geeky moodlet problem. Hmm. Seems like a possibility, but doesn't look like it really did all that much. Um, let's try flirting a little bit. I don't know how receptive she is going to be. Oh, she is not interested. Holy crap. Wow, what happened? I think she's just tense. Hmm. I don't know, that's crazy. <laughs> what if she flirts with him? I think it's just because they're tense. They need, like, video games in their lives. <laughs> Here, play a game. You both play games. See if that helps. He's tired, so he does need to go to bed. Okay, so they're happy. So what if she flirts with him? She wouldn't normally be the one to flirt, but I kind of want to get them going somewhere, you know? See? See, they're good now. Are they good? Are you guys good? I don't really believe it. Are you going to be receptive to it? Yeah. I want them to kiss, because they haven't really done a whole lot. Yeah! Okay. So he can go to bed. And so she can she. And when we return, um, we're going to be going with her to work. And she is going to build the satellite dish, which means that we increase our possibility of getting abducted. She might also go into space while she's at work, because we do have a working space ship. Okay, so we're awake at the moment. Ooh, something spoiled. Probably the Franken beans. She'll clean out the spoiled food. He needs to go to work soon. Alright, um... Sure, I guess he can go ahead and ponder moves. Okay. He's going to play for whatever time he has left to try to increase his fun. He doesn't have a whole lot of it, but we need to do our best. Because he leaves for work much sooner. Oh boy. She can repair this. Although it makes more sense for him to do it, but he needs to leave soon. 
Uh, send alone. Oh, he needs to go. You need to go to work, dude. Stop playing. Alright. And he can work hard. I wonder if these split into branches. I didn't actually look into that at all. I want her to be able to ponder moves. And I'm just going to throw this away because I don't have time for it. There we go. Try to ponder some moves. Please. Please, please, please. So she can be ready to go to work. Oh, well, that didn't really work out, but that's fine. We'll at least have a working sink again and a clean floor. All right. We're going to invent the satellite dish. Also, upgrade the samurai with mind control. What? Satellite dish. Invent it now, and we will be taking it home. And hopefully Otis will get abducted soon. Probably not in this episode, if we're being completely honest, but soon for sure. And I'm very excited about that. This, this just got so much more awesome. And I'm so excited. I wonder if she'll get abducted. She might get abducted, but I don't know because she's an alien, so it might be a little different. Is the... Rocket is still built. So cool. So I want her to go to space. If we can. So we'll see. And she is a serum sequencer now. She has these cool little glasses. Eye, protecting, eye protection glasses. Yes. We're going to put that in our inventory. Contact aliens. Oh boy. Okay, well let's let's upgrade our um, whatchamacallit and then we'll contact aliens. Where is our freeze ray? Am I just missing it? There it is. I, Bob. <laughs> I forgot that we named it that. Upgrade to mind control. Bob is turning into quite the dangerous weapon. Was that it? Oh, they just have to take a second to think about things, I guess. Strange. Neat. So we'll put that back in her inventory. So take a DNA sample from a sim. We'll do that in a second. What we're going to do is contact some aliens. Real quick. Hive mind angry to- What is this? Neighborhood what? Prevent abductions. Contact aliens. Go. Go, friend. This will bring aliens around. Maybe they'll even abduct us. Oh my goodness. Okay. So start neighborhood. So start neighborhood. Hive mind. Any of them? Um. Dance party. Let's do a dance party. What is. Alien contact. Alien conversation is somehow both intuitive and tactile. Sandra has activated dance party, which. Watch as the neighbors dance the night away. Oh my. What in the world? We are taking that home with us and it's going to be a beautiful thing. Are they going to start. Are they dancing? Um, snake oil. We need a daisy. Well, we have some daisies. Right? Rose. Daisy. Harvest. Yep, they're dancing, all right. That is wonderful. Oh no! Our thingy majig is a. Uh... What is this? Chat. So we got some. I think we got daisies now. So let's experiment and make some snake oil. Yeah. They are partying. I love it. That was awesome. This is so fun. I really like this career or profession, whatever you want to call it. Where is she at right now in hers? She's level four. It's not bad. You really shouldn't have a coffee cup on an experimenting table, but that's besides the point. Oh, Lord. Okay, well, let's replace that and try again. It's fine. We have plenty of daisies. That is extremely dangerous, which is why... <laughs> look at her face right there. Which is why you wear protective eye gear. That's great. Come on now. She's not going to stay late either because I want to be able to start implementing the 
uh, satellite dish. So I'm very excited about it. Obviously, in case you guys haven't noticed by the amount of times that I've talked about it and stated that I'm excited. Please don't screw this one up. Please. I'd like to see it work. Okay, so it might be tainted. So, we can- I want to try giving it away because I'm afraid of her drinking one again because that didn't really go very well. Nope, that didn't work. I don't understand how we give it away. Still. Out of something, order to garden. I can do that. Mind control, change outfit. Well, I'm going to order him to garden because that garden is hurting in a bad way. Alright, well, I don't see... It's, I still don't see where we can give it away, so... Why are we angry? Oh, it just won't work. Alright, well, let's go here and you can drink it. Let's see what happens on this when we drink this mystery serum. Oh, we're asleep. Great. Well, when you wake up, you're going to analyze a crystal. Actually, you're going to go to space when you wake up. If we have time. Which I don't really think we will. But, maybe. Well, hurry up now. Just pass out in the middle of the floor. Alright, let's explore space for a little while. It probably really won't get anywhere, but we can at least try. What's that up ahead? Cassandra cruises over for a closer look and sees a hulking old ship. It's flying a flag with a space, space cash symbol, which is the intergalactic symbol for commerce. It's a trader ship that wants to do business. Cassandra begins the docking procedure. He doesn't look like he really gardened at all, but whatever. The old trader ship is overflowing with cargo. He offers to let Cassandra keep some of the cargo if she'll transport the rest to his buyer on Earth. Cassandra's ship cargo, ship's cargo bay isn't very large, and the extra weight could crash her ship. Should, there, should she risk it or just take a little bit of the goods? Um. Ooh, let's take a little. We don't want to crash our ship. We just built it. All right, let's speed this up a little bit. Cassandra puts a paltry few boxes in the back of her ship. One box is smoking and another's making a whimpering sound, but Cassandra doesn't ask question questions. She delivers it on time and makes a few extra bucks. Cool. Well, that's good. Cassandra has returned safely from the cosmos. Good job. Good job, Cassandra. Good for you. I mean, he mostly took care of it, but there's still a lot of work that needs to be done in here. Like, look at all those weeds. You're not fooling anybody. What, were you taking a break? Excuses. Alright. We got a vacation day. Woo! Ow. My elbow just popped. Okay. So, we are back. And first things first. Putting this here. And this, oh, so we can only contact every 24 hours. That's fine. That's fine. We'll contact uh, the next time. And Otis, I think, will be the one who, well, actually, I wonder, can he do it? No. Okay. So he'll contact and see, you know, if we have him contact, then maybe it'll increase his chances. But I'm going to go ahead and end it here. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you in the next one. Bye.